Welcome to Flippin' Rejects with me, Shane Luthie. This week, I'm taking an item that I was given by a friend of mine a long time ago. My buddy Steve gave me the top half of the motor to his 1978 CB400 uh, motorcycle. And I took, the, took part of that at one point and repurposed it into an iPod charging station and music player. This time, I'm taking the other part of the motor and I'm going to build this into kind of an artsy little shop robot. I hope it turns out great. We'll see. Let's get started. Along with the top end of the motorcycle engine, I was given some Jeep front end parts from another friend of mine. This is what I'll use for the body portion of the robot. Here I'm just soaking them in a degreaser just to get them nice and clean before I start grinding and welding them together. Here I'm using an angle grinder just to grind the surface of the pieces that I'll weld together. Now I haven't welded in about 20 years, so this was a little bit of a challenge for me trying to relearn a skill. I think it turned out okay. There's a lot of slag that I didn't grind away just because I wanted it to look like this little robot possibly put itself together in a post-apocalyptic world. Now that most of the torso is being welded together, I'm moving on to these torsion bar keys that I'm using as the legs.
I welded some industrial piping for the neck and the waist as well as the arms and shoulders. Since I couldn't weld to this aluminum cylinder head, I had to drill out some holes to put an industrial piping flange base that I can screw to the neck to attach the head. After getting everything assembled, I attached the robot to a wooden base just to keep it standing straight up. I also decided to attach a Edison bulb into the center of it, kind of symbolic of a heart. Here I'm just drilling a hole in the back leg just to run the lamp cord. Here I'm just adding a lamp cord switch that will power on and off the robot's Edison bulb heart. Quick check of everything, put the light bulb in, and this post-apocalyptic scrap robot is finished. If you like the video, make sure you leave comments in the comment section and hit that like button. shoulders just gotta stay in keep my eye on the ball just basic stuff man i hear what you're saying i hear you oh hey uh just out here hitting some balls at the driving range with the robot you just watched me build if you like this video hit the subscribe button if you really like it, hit that bell and you'll get a notification every time I take some scrap metal or whatever and flip it and make it into something cool. Uh, I'm going to keep hitting some balls, so y'all go out and make something awesome. Have a good day. Yeah, i got to keep my shoulders square.